Your live Doppler 18 forecast with meteorologist Sarah McKenna. Weather from where you live. Good morning. Well, we are continuing to track those rain showers right now in Lafayette. It's just some light scattered rain, but you can see up near Rensselaer, some of the heaviest rain right now. That does go over across the Logansport area as well, from Logansport just on to the north, looking like it's going up a little bit through the Rochester area. We're going to see rain like this all day long. Some places are going to stay dry. This morning, it's Crawfordsville. Frankfurt looks like you may be seeing some rain showers here soon, but right now, Crawfordsville dry. It looks like we are going to be seeing some rain, though, kind of with this light pattern. Then and the heavier ones embedded within that all day long. Now, take a look at how this all moves in. Take a look at how it all started. And actually, it started off yesterday afternoon more in these southern counties. You can see then it's kind of lifted a bit more to the north. There's still plenty of chances for rain. So if you're looking forward to some, you're dry right now, don't worry. It's not going to stay that way all day. More moisture is coming this way. Another push to bring that cold front through coming this way as well. It looks like we're going to be seeing those rain showers throughout the day. While your temperature right now in the 70s, Futurecast is showing those rain showers again. They're going to be here. Another wave kind of comes through right around that five o'clock hour and looks like that will continue through the evening. And as we head into Friday, I think it's going to continue. You notice this is just ending your day today. Throughout Friday, it looks like we're going to be seeing some of those heavy storms. Now, of course, that's Friday morning as most people will be sleeping. But as you head off to work, I wouldn't be surprised to see maybe a few lingering showers, but we are going to start to clear out pretty quickly thereafter. In fact, as we head into the day on Friday, this cold front is going to leave. You can actually see it kind of redevelops back across Ohio. For us, though, we're going to see it all kind of wrap around, rotate counterclockwise with the low pressure system this is all associated with, give us maybe a little bit more cloud cover. But overall, the temperatures are going to be really, really nice. For today, though, rain and thunderstorms, strong winds at time, 83 degrees for your high. You see that wind gusting up to 25 miles an hour. Tonight, down to 64 degrees as that rain and thunderstorm continue. Friday, early showers. It's going to be much cooler, though, 75 degrees for your high for Friday, wind gusting up to 30 miles an hour. And again, I think we'll see a mixture of cloud cover. It'll all kind of clear out before we kind of get those clouds that come back this way because of the low pressure. Now, taking a look at the rest of your seven day forecast you'll notice that as we go into your day saturday cooler temperatures only 70 degrees for your high on saturday starting off saturday at 50 degrees we'll start sunday off the same way warm up a little bit more though and labor day we do get back